The earthquake hit town of Pozzuoli in Italy fears the Campi Flegre supervolcano is ready to erupt. Pozzuoli residents are used to the smells, smoke, and even the occasional ground shaking. Pozzuoli, a picturesque port town outside Naples, is now a place where conversations revolve around fear and uncertainty following seismic activity around the area's supervolcano, known as as Campi Flegre, or Flegrean Fields. The region is named after the ancient Greek word for burning, and is aptly named because sulfurous smoke often rises from the ground, creating a surreal atmosphere that attracts tourists. Pozzuoli residents are used to the smell, smoke, and even the occasional earth tremor. In September alone, there were more than a thousand small earthquakes. However, a magnitude 4.2 earthquake on September 27, the strongest in more than 40 years, sparked concerns about a possible seismic crisis. This term has not been used since the early 1980s. Although this large earthquake did not cause significant structural damage, it, along with about 500 smaller earthquakes in October, has left residents on edge. Anna Maria Scardi, the mother of two teenagers, expressed concern, even about smaller earthquakes. Fear of imminent evacuation adds to stress. He, like everyone else, wondered where they would go if such an order was issued. Experts stressed that there was no immediate threat of a volcanic eruption, but they were concerned about the heaving of the ground, which could destabilize buildings. Land shifts, known as Brady SISM, are related to the filling and emptying of magma chambers deep beneath the Earth's surface. During a similar crisis four decades ago, this situation continued for several years, leading to the temporary evacuation of 40,000 people from Pozzuoli, famous as the hometown of actress Sophia Loren. Today, families grapple with differences of opinion. Vincenzo Russo, for example, wants to stay put, while his wife and children look for a house in a safer area. Constant fear and constant tremors have weighed on the population, creating a sense of unease. However, not everyone is overcome by fear. Some people, like Angelo Prezzini and his friends, continued with their daily activities. Prezzini, 78, was prepared to defy evacuation orders, while 66-year-old Luigi Ilardi was more steadfast, having become accustomed to seismic activity in the region. Today, the people of Pozzuoli live in uncertainty, where every shock reminds them of the potential dangers that lurk beneath the Earth's surface.